The Hawthorne effect is the tendency we have to perform better when we know somebody is studying us. For example, a 2015 study of hospital staff handwashing found that staff were almost three times more likely to wash their hands when they knew they were being studied. The term Hawthorne effect comes from an experiment conducted at a US factory run by General Electric in Hawthorne near Chicago during the 1920s into factors that affected productivity. Everything worked. Increasing the illumination of the factory boosted productivity. Dimming the lights boosted productivity. Introducing rest pauses also worked. So did small group incentives. Oddly, after a positive change, returning to previous work conditions was also met with positive results. One popular interpretation of these results is that the novelty of being observed leads humans to perform tasks better. When we feel we're being studied, we improve our behaviour. While the experiment has been described as a glorified anecdote and it certainly falls well short of modern social science, it gives rise to this famous Hawthorne effect. Modern studies have confirmed the presence of this effect in a range of scenarios. For example, when teachers are observed in classrooms, they can exhibit better teaching behaviours than when left to their own devices. In my own work, I've had participants literally say, I was going to do A, but I knew you were coming in, so I did B. While this can be a cause of frustration for researchers, it has implications for teachers. When students know they're being studied and valued, their performance improves. It also means that professional practice projects in schools, whatever they may be, will usually result in improved teaching outcomes. So, get into teams, observe each other, it'll almost certainly work. When humans know they're being studied, their performance usually improves. That is the Hawthorne effect.